Hi and welcome to my channel and welcome to a new video. We are continuing our Guide of War journey. So for that, let's go going. I hope you enjoy. So we are in uh, Helheim. We had this fight with the Keeper and got its heart. And now we have to get back, I think. Psst. Yeah. Shh. It ain't supposed to be here. It's cold. Real quick, give me your blades. Why? Yeah, I said I'd help you and I aim to. Come on. Oh, yeah. Let me guess. One hammer bonk and that's it. Uh, my equipment's in Midgard. Be right back. Yeah. You don't suppose he nicked those, do you? There. Now they're ready for the winds of hell. Just target this magical <laughs> goalie bit here with your blades and throw. Oh. Winds of Hell. Winds of Hell are very unstable and can only be held for 10 seconds before returning to the last wind trap. Now target that wind trap with your blades. It's that little ball hanging in the middle of the door there. See that? Now you can absorb and release the winds of hell whenever it damn pleases. So you're welcome and I'm leaving. This place is cold enough to freeze a pair of pigeon eggs. I sometimes wonder if there was once some sort of accident in his brain. We have been away too long. Huh. Okay. And what now? Oh yeah. We get the door open. Cool. Uh, capture then transfer the winds of hell to power devices. So again, we got a new way to, you know, backtrack and find things that we haven't been able to do before. So that's really convenient. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. I have a dummy. Yeah, we have to transfer this to here. Yeah, now I get it. Okay. Yeah, and I think I should fight or try fighting unarmed here, but let's see. Let's focus now getting out of here. But actually, yeah. Good thing that I turned back because I want to see what's here. Though I think that I can't access here without the boy's help, so... Okay. Ouch. Oh, come on. And let's rage, because why not? Oh, more of you? Okay. Okay. So, I want to see what's on this side. Nothing. I guess. So, yeah. Okay. Oh yeah. Let's burn these thorns and then we will be on our way. Sorry brother, I'm still stuck in what I heard back there. Zeus was your father? Not now. We should focus on getting out of hell. And with that I cannot argue. I'll just contemplate that little nugget in silence then. Hmm. 
Okay, that's that. We should get this open now. Yeah. Good. What is it? Oh no. One of these enemies. Well, sure. Why not? Pummel. Well, we won that fight, but yeah, to be honest, didn't went that well. Ouch. transfer the source anymore because I hope so let's see if we can do that right We missed that. Oh, a sarcophagus. Solid steel. Good. That's all that's nice. What about here? Nothing? Yeah, just a um, point where you can reset the timer. Just like this one. And now let's try to get this here. Where's the next point? Well, at least we are having a fight over here. Fair. Oh, 
away with you. And away with you. Nice. Please drop some health stones for me. Please. No. Okay. Ah. Nice. Oof. That's that. And yeah. Oh. There's a chest up here. I didn't see it earlier. But yeah, some silver will do. I hope that I can get this further. I don't know exactly where, but... Hmm... Why you can put that? And do you exactly need it or not? Ooh! Light runic attack for these blades. Cool. Well, by a quick glance, I don't see where we could put that source, so yeah, just ignore that and go forward, I guess. Oh, there's something, eh? Confused. How can I bring that thing over here? Yeah, we got this kind of chest over here. Cool! Lightronic attacks. I must say that, oh boy, that wasn't an easy one. Like, you need a perfect timing on those throws and on your paths where you are gonna run. Yeah, we made it. Sure, let's um talk to Proc because I want to upgrade my blades. Well, it seems that we can't upgrade our blades yet. We need some world serpent scales. We shouldn't delay, brother. 
Head straight back to Midgard with that heart. Yeah, let's go back to Midgard, to the witch's place, and try to rescue our boy. Hopefully we will get there without any troubles. So, let's go. Your father, Zeus? I finally understand! I'm dangling from the hip of the bloody ghost of Sparta! Do not call me that. What? Oh, don't mistake me, brother. From what I heard, the Pantheon had it coming. It's still a bit to take in. I knew you hate gods, but you really can't stay away from them, can you? You must say nothing to the boy. He must never know. Bollocks, brother. Respectfully, bollocks. He has to know. He'll never be whole without the truth. Look, I get it. You hate the gods. All gods. It's no accident that includes yourself. And it includes your boy. You see that? He feels that. He can't help what he is. He can't begin to help it because you haven't even told him. It's all connected, man. You will tell him nothing. Very well. So you know that shortcut between realms? Well, I made it better. Hmm. Or I might have broke it. We use that. I know you do. So I took a few cuss from them winds of hell and made it so it ain't just one way. Now you can use it to travel to and from. If I didn't break it. Then we can take it to Freya. There's an idea, brother. Huh. Might be some kinks to sort out, but you'll make it. Just go, brother. So we can fast travel to the witch's cave. Well, you gentlemen certainly know how to get around. But yeah, Mimir knows, Frega knows. And Kratos doesn't want to tell to boy that Kratos is a god. So I'm just wondering who will tell the boy first that Kratos is a god. But we'll see that eventually. Well, this isn't right. Ah, but close enough. He did say there were kinks. We must hurry. Yeah. Inside. Now. You have it. Yes. Back of your hand. He is too ill. I can break the fever, but to heal... He must know the truth of what he is. Yes. It is not so simple. Help me prop him up. Did I tell you that I have a son, too? It's been... forever since I last saw him. At his birth, the runes foretold a needless death. Babe in my arms was so small, so helpless. I knew right then I would do anything to protect him, no matter the sacrifice. Of course, everything I did, I did for myself. I let my needs, my fears, come before what he needed. And I couldn't see his resentment until it was too late. Don't make the same mistake. Have faith in him. I know the truth isn't simple. But nothing is when it involves your child. It 
It is a curse. The boy has been cursed. Forget this. Thanks. Your father did the heavy lifting. You should stay, recover. You have done enough. You know my door is always open to you. That's Venon, isn't it? You figured that out, did you? Well, the window looks like Bifrost Crystal, and I know that's not what's on the other side of the wall. And, well, it makes you sad. You are wise for one so young. Yes, this is a window to a home I left long ago, but it is only a few. The thing that happened to you in Alphon, you can't leave Midgard, can you? A gift from my former husband upon our separation. Why would Odin trap you in Midgard? Petty cruelty would be reason enough for him, but as with all his rash decisions, he's driven by fear. The Vanir were the greatest threat to the Aesir until our marriage brokered peace. Many of the Vanir now think I betrayed them, the fruits of my sacrifice. To be hated by my own kind, to trap me here, is to ensure I can never make it right. Um, so I was wondering, why do you live under a turtle? <laughs> he was my first friend here in Midgard. He offered me shelter, and in return I provide him with protection against the evils of the forest. Golden boar, giant turtle, he sure has some interesting friends. So at least the boy is alive, for now. And we got out of Helheim, which is a good thing, but I think that we have to return there because there is at least one place that we can access with the help of the boy. But again, this is a good spot to end our episode and continue from this point in the next episode. So thank you for watching this episode. If you liked the video, please leave a like. And if you want to see more content from me in the future, maybe consider to subscribe my channel. But until the next episode, have a great day and bye bye.